It's not over, says the Lord. I'm not done with you yet. I have many things that I'm going to reveal to you. Many doors will be open unto you. I have given you the keys to my kingdom. And though you have frustrated yourself with trying to open up doors, I'm going to instruct you on how to use them. You can't use the wrong keys for the things that will open up the right doors. You can't have them upside down. You have to put them in all the way, and you have to turn them the right and correct way. I will not only reveal unto you how to use the keys, but I will give you good success. I will place my hand upon your hand so that you will get it right. I will open the doors for you so that you will no longer frustrate yourself. You won't be pounding on them. You will not be on the outside saying, open to us. I have granted you access, says the Lord. I'm granting you access to my wisdom. I'm granting you access to my knowledge, to my understanding that is infinite. I'm giving you access that goes far beyond what you call grace. I'm giving you favor. I'm giving you greater favor. I am giving you access to my blessings where there will not be any sorrow attached. You will not be taxed with my blessings. You will not be stretched. You will not wish that you were absent of them. I will give you blessings that I will pour out upon you, that will bring you favor, that will bring you the supply that you need that will be more than enough for you. For you need to look unto me, who is the author and the finisher of your faith, who is the author and finisher and completer of your salvation, who is the author and finisher and completer of every promise that I have given unto you. I will fulfill it, says the Lord, and it will not be taxing to you. It will not be something that causes you to be encumbered and weary. I have given you access into my presence, access to my peace, access to my provision, access to my glory, access to my presence, access to my Holy Spirit and power. I have given you access to myself, and I have heard your prayers, and I will answer them and give you an answer of peace, says the Lord. Your portion is not emptiness. Your portion is not despair. Your portion is not alienation. Your portion is not fruitlessness. Your portion is of me, and I have a bountiful blessing for you. And I will make you a blessing. And because I make you a blessing, you will not add sorrow, grief, and pain to the people around you. You will be a blessing that's not attached with sorrow. You will not be a blessing that can't
can be infiltrated with darkness and deceit. I will make you a blessing and I will complete every good work that I have begun in you. For I am God. I am the living God. I am your God. And I am your beginning and your end, which will be abundance of peace and joy and love and provision and yes, 